That's Millie's Lament. Uh, it's from Mary and the Matrons. And th- this was at the Barnfield uh, towards the end of last year, just for a very short run and uh, in, in development. There, there was a bit of... The, the story uh, sort of took a, took a few leaps. I think there's a few missing scenes that will appear later on. And um, the, the sound wasn't quite quite right they had, they had to stop occasionally bits of feedback the sort of thing that happens in the, in this studio quite quite a lot as well um so they were they're still working on it but uh, i i think that sound is now I mean, that's all in a studio but clearly that they're they're, get, they're getting it very well together and uh i'm i'm sure they'll find somewhere for a longer run with more more resource in the production um so I'll, i've got i think i think there's, there's certainly one more there might be there might be two more i'm trying to find youtube youtube surely somebody is going to come up with an interface to youtube that that allows you to line up tracks in a studio uh because uh it just makes so much sense, and otherwise everybody's going to discover their music through social media, and radio's going to be left left way way behind. But anyway, while I while I work out the mysteries of YouTube, here's another uh, Marvin Gaye track. 